Oh, you piece of shit. <laughs> a heavy work bench. Oh yeah. <laughs> I, I, I said you're a piece of dog shit or something to someone. Uh, good question. At what point do other people realize what you already realized? I don't know, man. They're, you know. Like, uh, they hated Jesus because they told him the truth. <laughs> it's like, uh, uh, you know, I don't know if you know what, what I want to say. Basically, like, I asked toasters. Oh, why did I die? I had a fairy. Hello? Oh, That's see? Why you died? <laughs> No, it, it did revive me, never mind. Anyway, what I tried to say, I asked Toasters why he didn't leave or something. Yeah. And he said that he just wants to do it for fun. And I'm like, uh, no, it's not a good reason. It's in the play. It can be placed. It resonates with otherworldly energy. Yes. That's that red thing in the middle is. Obviously, with the exception of the um, lava. Wait, what's the worst name then? It's in the play. Like... I just don't understand. Why would anyone code for Realm instead of just making their own game? Yeah, or, you know, get paid to do it. Exactly. That too. Because there's, like, it's it's actually worth money. They're making a living off of it. Yeah. It's like, lol, Realm. No, but an 8 by 8 spread's not worth money. Mm. Holy shit, this is actually horrible. Hold on. So it's an end game material, basically. End game material? And it's only found on the largest planetoid, there's limited amounts of it per world. And we each Oh my god! Huh. Yeah. What can it be made into? A dimensional soul artifact, Eldritch soul artifact. Godly oh soul my god. And another soul bolt artifact. What do these artifacts do though? That's a real question. <laughs> it summons, yeah, these boss summons basically. Okay. Uh, I'll pull them back where I found them then. No! <laughs> oh, time to reset. Hmm? Uh, Zelda for the SNES. SNES. Yes. Oh shit, I just jumped off the ledge. Let's, let's reset again. I'm it's funny because I... I didn't get revived a piece of shit game. Hmm? I can't believe I didn't get revived a piece of shit game. Fuck this. I know, right? It's funny because I started playing the game because, uh, like, in, uh... In this game, if you like uh, hug the corner for a wall, it moves you like around that wall. And I tried, I wanted to replicate that, which I did. But then I was like, hey, this game's actually good. So I started playing it. I want to test something. Okay. Test it, okay. So, so, so the slime thing literally removes all fucking full damage, basically. I, I just yeeted off a fucking... <laughs> yeah, I, I, I eat off a city, a uh, sky city, whatever it is. That's like the funniest yeah. verb ever. Yeet. I, I love it. <laughs> I yeeted. He has been yeeten off the cliff. So, so what's our plans for the future? Yes. Good. Holy shit, this like, room. Do you actually have any plans now? There's still some bosses. Yeah, I'm still gonna go for the Wall of Flesh and stuff, I know that, but like, anything else. Before we, before we start heading on to that. Because when we're going to that, it's going to take quite a bit of time to settle up set everything, because we've got like, like a long ass fucking walkway, so. It's going to take a while to do. Holy shit. Whenever I watch fucking the French stream, he's always fucking playing Terraria music in the background. Yeah. Terraria has nice music. Ooh, Golden Scroll. Yeah. 
Oh, you know what song I haven't heard in a while? The fucking underground theme. <laughs> Take a mug. I got him, I got him. Ah, yes. I'm gonna give it a sec. The fucking memories of mother slimes dropping from the sky and slamming me. Okay, do we the area does actually end? Heavy workbench. Is that is that more useful than anything else we currently oh, have? Oh shit! You can pretty much use it only for fucking crafting stone leather and shit. It's kind of bad. Can I sell it? Hold it. Oh god. God, oh fuck! He took the kit. What the fuck's even hitting me? Cheeto, the cheeto. Oh, that's hitting me. Damn, six gold for the fucking hellwing bow. Why is there a death thing right here? What? Oh, fuck's sake. No, not the bunny. <sighs> this game is actually hard. What is this? Where's my pets in this game? Oh, I'm almost dead. It's not even my pet, just any regen. <laughs> like when you play a game that has no regen and only like a couple of hits, it's like, oh shit. Can't open the door. <laughs> yeah, because there's, there's shit blocking it. <laughs> I don't really want to go play Rust. Fuck. My friends are still on CS. Aren't we your friends? Hello? Yeah, what the fuck? Prehistoric Amber Staff. Summons a T-Rex or angry Pterodactyl to attack your foes. Life uh, finds a way. <laughs> what did you let them in for? Cunt. What's busy doing things? I just made the baby T-Rex then. Fuck. Finally. And you and I gonna start making ASMR videos. Oh god, yeah. Is my voice that good? It's not. Yes. Just get a good microphone and start talking about fucking realm. Oh, what the fuck? He, sh he shoots more shots now. Make a realm to mad got ASMR. At I mean, I I have a I have a better mic than this. I just need to. I, like I don't know, <laughs> what what is it with me today? I I want to say something and then I try to say it and it's like oh no I don't know I don't know what I want to say. Hey guys, today we're making this my realm. We're going to be farming orcs for some defense potions. I hope you enjoy me on this adventure. Now today do we? Going to make the, uh, <laughs> do we? We're going to make the nest. Nest boss shotgun ASMR. Oh. <laughs> do we? Do you have a pop filter for your mic or not? Yes, I do. Oh, Hang on. I, I wasn't using it when I was doing that. Then well, yeah, this yeah. is really a pop filter. Okay, okay. Yeah, I was gonna say. Today, guys, we're going to be 
farming some lamps to try and farm some <laughs> Nice. Like, when I, whenever I go on VC, I just use my headset. It's just a bit more convenient. <laughs> and usually for, like... Mike is always there, so it's fine. Hmm. Oh, shit. Where's the guy down? There he is. Amber, Amber, Amber. Zero. I wish there's a way to search. Actually, look in uh, Discovery Channel. Alright, let's see. What have we got? Ah, kitty. Cat. I like Taco's picture better though. Is a very smart kitty. But I like I like the uh older picture of the fucking picture of Hydra's cat. The cat looks so fucking concerned. <laughs> or confused, do we? Visibly confused. Do we look at the Hydra's cat? Look how confused he is. Now she is. Look how confused she is. She's so lost. <laughs> I like. Do you have any amber on you? I cannot find uh, it anywhere. Go mine over there, man. You can. Uh, no, I, I literally have some. Do you guys have an extractor? Yes. Yes. You can get us from that. Yeah, no, I, I knew we had some. I, li I literally um I pressed this quick sack thing by chest and stuff like that, and it disappeared from inventory. So I knew we had some somewhere, but it wasn't in the right place. Probably mm. valuables. Yeah, it was invaluable, I already found it. Oh yeah, you can aim chests, can't you? Like I wanted to do this. Oh my god, I'm getting killed. Hey! Oh, why isn't he spawning? Oh, there he is. Be gone. Thought? Oh yeah. Where is green PewDiePie? I literally never watched PewDiePie. No, green PewDiePie. Who is that? Jacksepticeye? Yes. yes. I, I was actually gonna say it. <laughs> Dewey, what did you do? Look, what did you craft that thing with? I want it to. No, fuck you. Mine now. Look, what did you pay for it? Uh, I don't even have any of that. I, I have literally nothing left for it now. Uh, yeah, fossils, yeah, amber, and blood. Blood. Nice. I have no um no fossils left. Like I had literally dead on enough to make it, so Holy fuck he just killed everything. Load, boy. Let's see, with that as well, or I can do, um... There he is. This is what I wanted. Is he broken? No, there he is. Fuck. He's trying his hardest, okay? He got so far. Look at him go. So you can either have a T-Rex, which is like a grounded melee, or you have um the other one, so, uh, Pterodactyl. I, I think I'll pass them for the T-Rex, because the melee seems to be a bit more faster. More faster. Yes. Yeah, I think I'm going to stick with this now, I guess I said my like, uh, thanks stuff. Well, give me the other stuff you didn't use. The dank stuff? No. That one. The, the flying boy. 
No, th this isn't from the same one. What? It's, it's the exact same stat for both of them. It just has a chance to spawn in one or the other. Ah, okay. Hold on, if you want to play on a modded server, you, I guess you have to have the mod installed like locally, right? For both players? Yes. Yeah, uh, you, so? you just have to have the same mod, same mod and you can just connect through Steam. Ah, yeah. okay, that's not too bad. Like, as long as you're both discussing the way downloading and everything, it's alright. Yeah. It's not what you're downloading, it's what you're enabling slash disabling sort of thing, so. Oh shit, it's 8 o'clock in it. Um, yeah, oh. I'm probably gonna go then for a bath some map. So, yes. I'm guessing Loom's probably gonna go fucking rust. Yeah, if my friend has come from CS, then hell yeah. Alright. Sure, go. I do. I do expect the Terraria stream still, though. <laughs> maybe, <laughs> maybe, late, maybe not today, but uh, it's it's going to come. Yeah, I was kidding. Yeah. Um. Good night, boys. Peace. Uh, later. Fuck man. And then uh, I'm not involved in afterwards. I, I think I have a YouTube to catch up on maybe. Let me take a look. Yeah. I don't think I'm in a single player game to play nowadays. Pretty much every game I fucking play is with the Lumi, so I can't play it until Lumi comes on. <laughs> <laughs> like, Terraria's not too bad because I, I can do like some offline farm or something like that, but it's not there. Yeah. Which isn't too bad. But we ain't, we ain't got nothing more to farm at the moment until we do the Wall of Flesh. So, I don't know if someone can do it without him, sort of thing, so. Um, we started playing The Division recently, but. We were also playing out of Yugi, which then also means another person we have to wait for to be able to <laughs> play it. So it's like, uh, yeah, it's like I, I enjoy the game, but like, uh, yeah, it's tough to have it all lined up all the time. Yeah, like we had the same problem with Borderlands. We started playing with like four people, and I don't know. It's, it's just having fun the right time for everyone to be together, and everyone also. It isn't said that everyone has to be free at the time. Everyone, everyone has to want to play the game at that time as well. Yep. 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 Because like, you might want to play it and then others might be like, eh, I'm not really feeling it today, which is understandable. Mm -hmm. But then it's just like, it's a bit of a bummer if you do want to play. Yeah. <laughs> like, I could make a second character on there and go like solo or something like that with it. Uh -huh. But then it's just like, I'll end up playing the same stories over again when I go back to play with them too. So I'm just like, yeah. I mean, and Lumi both said though that um, if Yugi doesn't sort of come on top and all that, we'll end up, well, we're going to make our own characters play as a duo with them there. And then whenever Yugi comes on, we can go back to how the characters play with Yugi. Because we don't think he'll end up playing with us often. He could end up proving us wrong, for all we know, but... Mm -hmm. I think that's time he said he was going to play Rust with us, and he hasn't really sort of jumped into Rust with us yet, so... What what kind of game is Rust, anyway? Uh... It, it's... A, hmm. It's a survival game, basically, where like, you got to build your own base and shit like that. But at the same time, you... Okay, so put it this way. It's a game that enhances the toxicity of people. So, if, if everyone that played the game online was friendly and everything, mm -hmm. everyone in the game could advance so much fucking further. Uh. <laughs> then the only real obstacle in the game is each other. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so then, that's exactly it. Like, most of the survival games have some sort of PvE. PV, like, if you play Ark, for example, there's like the dinosaurs and shit in there. You have PvE only servers because the dinosaurs themselves can fuck you over. You don't have to deal with the players on there. Yeah. Whereas Rust is all about going against other people. <laughs> so, as you can understand, Rust, Rust is a pretty toxic game. Because <laughs> th that's what the game is based around. It, it relies on people being toxic to each other, basically. Uh -huh. <laughs> Smudo just tuned into the stream and he listened to you explain and he, and he just said the games are indeed cutthroat as fuck. Yeah, <laughs> it's as simple as that, basically. <laughs> That seems um, funny. <laughs> it's one of a kind. It's fun to play. Like, the game wipes. It depends on what sort of server you play, basically. Like, you can play on some servers that don't wipe until, like, every month. I think uh -huh. the, the average is about once every two weeks, once every week. But then you also have what you call blueprint wipes. So, I think normally they probably do, like, a one-week a one week structure wipe and, like, inventory wipes stuff like that. But then you keep your blueprints for, like, a month or something like that. Which is... It's typically what I've played whenever i played with Lumi or some other stuff like that. But... This is about the best I can describe it really. Hmm. There's no real quote unquote end to the game. You just get better to shit on more people. <laughs> <laughs> that's probably the best I can describe it, if anything. Uh, I think that's I think that's I think that's appealing for people. It reminds me a bit of uh, 
Like those, uh, what's it called? I don't know what it's called again, but it's like one of those I.O. games. Where you, sm you start... Oh, slither, slither I.O. Yeah, 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 stuff like that. Yeah, yeah, It's nothing except from just, just well, I guess the them ones, it's actually like a point, of, you know, get, get to the top of the leaderboard and become like the best on there is and stuff like that. But I guess at the same time, it is literally just, it's a pure PvP-based game, basically. <laughs> It's as simple as that. It's PvP mixed for survival. That's just pretty much what the game is. Oh, you can meet some nice people and they're actually a friend up and stuff like that. Like, oftentimes, if you're based next to someone, sometimes the people will try and like keep on good terms with you simply because if both of you are at war with each other and you right, live right next to each other, you can be focused more on that and you're not, not going to have to leave your house to fucking farm or whatever. Uh -huh. So, like, we often try to make friends with our neighbors and stuff like that. And then we'd, if we ever raided, we'd go like quite far away from our place and go raid and stuff like that. Yeah. Because we don't want fucking our neighbours to shoot us every time we leave the house. <laughs> <laughs> so. But like, obviously, there's certain servers where, like, um, let's say you kind of do singles, duos, trios, and stuff like that to prevent, like, you know, a clan of, like, ten people or something, and you're just sat there and you're fucking ones. Like, what do I do? Yeah. But just because you can only group up in that many people, it doesn't mean you can't, I guess, have an alliance in some way, I guess, where you just... Not, not exactly an alliance, more of a, a treaty. Yeah, um, yeah, yeah. Yeah, there's something a, tr a truce. Yeah, a truce, that's what I was looking for, yeah. You just agree not to shoot each other, basically. Yeah, yeah. That's just right. I, th I think we did that once, we had like a neighbor that was right next to us. Like, I think I think it was on a d duo trio server. They were a tr trio, me and uh, Lumi were just a duo. Two nice people. Reminds me a bit of uh, I was a thing on Reddit where you like you have to make a circle, and then oh yeah 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 um, <laughs> um, secret circle because you have to get like a password or something like that and you invite someone to it and then one person can fuck it up or some shit. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah. Fuck, fuck, Nigel invited me to one of them. Like, I, I felt so tempted to fuck it up. I was like, nah, I'll, I'll be I'll be a good guy. Mm. Oh a, shit! It's interesting. I didn't quite understand what I was doing it when I first did it. So I, I think I, I fucked up the first time I did it. So, <laughs> like, I ended up commenting a password, I think, instead of submitting it or some shit. I, I don't quite know. Uh. Yeah. Um, what are the games we were playing at the moment? We were, we were playing Destiny 2 for quite a while, but we stopped playing it, I think, just before Christmas, because that's when we got into. I don't remember now. We're going to another game we started playing, but I don't really was. Hmm. But, um... Yeah, so, so, so we started playing another game, and we haven't, we haven't, haven't got back into it since recently. They've, they've had a few updates and shit, but I just... I just can't get back into it yet. Destiny's a huge time sink. Yeah, I, I hear it's like similar to Realm, but of course better. And Realm is a, yeah. huge, Realm is a huge time sink. <laughs> Just imagine realm, but like FPS guns, basically. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I saw. I, I I think I saw a stream of you once. You were form. You were like fighting some worm boss. Ah, yeah. yeah. I was doing the strikes, and I guess that that'd be strike. But yeah, it's it's just a good game, but like I just have to be in the right mind frame just to be able to sit there and grind and whatnot. Mm. This is and it's one of those things that they're gonna keep releasing more updates for and content for and stuff. Like that. And I'm, I'm gonna go back into the game, but like, what the fuck do I even start with now? Because like already, there's already so many quests I've got on hand that I need to finish off or whatever, and I just I just can't get around to doing them. Some of them are like a massive pain in the ass. Like one of them, I've got to reach like um, I, I got to reach a certain rank in PvP, but once you start getting higher ranks, it becomes fucking horrid because the matchmaking in the game is a lot of people complain about it because the matchmaking is pretty fucked on there. Like they'll often put like four teams of solo players against uh -huh. a pre-made four, four stacks. So I think four stacks <laughs> has a huge advantage because they actually have fucking communication into Yeah, yeah, <laughs> So it's fucking horrid. Apparently, apparently they're going to be re reworking it all sooner, which would be nice, because it's not actually them who do it. It's the... I, I think they hire another company to do their matchmaking for them. So, it's so much to do with them, apparently. We had another company? Yeah, they're sort of... I don't know what the company's name is, but they have, like, a second company that basically handles all the matchmaking and stuff like that. Uh -huh. Rather than it being on their end. But I'm interested to see where Destiny, if there is a Destiny 3, because they're saying they're potentially. There are rumors going around at the moment, basically saying that they may end up just making Destiny 2 and like sticking with it, sort of thing, rather than go for a Destiny 3. Or potentially the next Destiny game means there won't be a Destiny 4, it will just be Destiny 3, and then it will just be 
Or when we call Destiny 3, we call something else, but then it would just be like, um... Spiritual like, successor. Yeah, you might imagine like WoW or whatever, where it's the same game, but you just release expansions and stuff like that. Like huge expansion packs, and you have like smaller expansions in between and stuff like that. Yeah. People are like, like kind of expecting that's what it's going to be like, because they're saying, um... They're sort of putting history together or some shit like that. I'll have to try and dig out the post to get an exact quote for it again, but... But the game's future looks bright compared to when the game was first released. When the game was first released, fuck me. <laughs> it, it was it was in a hell of a state. Why? It, 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 was, it was made for casuals. Like, when they released Destiny 2, it was made for casuals. It was as simple as that. Uh -huh. Like, there was... The, the entire game is about grinding. So, imagine, like, how realms have come now, basically. Where they literally basically hand everything to you in event chest and stuff like that. Yeah. God. De Destiny 2 was, like, everything dropped so often. And there's no real fun ways to grind it. Like right now, there's so many ways to grind what you want, basically. Obviously, there's certain quests that require you to do specific things to get that certain item. For example, um, some items only drop from the raids and stuff like that. Obviously, for good reason, those items are really good. Mm -hmm. Which is the reason why they, they only drop from raids. But obviously, most of the items, like... I guess Destiny 2 version of white bags are called exotics. Which right, are like right. powerful unique items. Yeah, they're, they're like powerful uni unique items have pretty low drop rates. Like they, they used to drop really commonly before, which is the reason why people weren't really a fan of them. Yeah. Because it, the game became too easy. Obviously, people that sort of played the game, jumped on, played it for a little bit, came off it, quote unquote casuals, I guess. They, they, were, they weren't too fussed about it, to be honest. But obviously, the, the people that were there for since Destiny 1, the hardcore players, which mm -hmm. they also just lost interest, basically. And then eventually. I think the first DLC they released was like complete wank. It was pretty shit. Yeah, basically. Nothing really added to it. Like, th there was a quote unquote grind there, but it wasn't a proper grind. It was just literally, yeah, you know, go in the same thing over and over again. You get this thing. Okay, that's it. Yeah, there so basically. No sort of side content or anything. You just finish off the campaign and you're done. Yeah, that, that does sound like what Realm is turning into. <laughs> yeah. Or has turned into, I should say. So it was a bit meh. But then, um, second DLC came out, War Mind. It was a bit better. There was a bit more things. There was a few new activities. There was, um, a bit more stuff to try and grind and stuff like that. So it became a bit better. Not, not, not great. It wasn't enough to sort of pull me back into the game sort of thing, but it was, it was, it was definitely better than what it was. And then Forsaken release, which was like, the huge turnaround basically it was at this point they were like okay drop rates everything nerfed rebalanced a lot of shit they changed their weapon because the weapon slots are a pretty big one for people as well because originally you had two kinetics and um one heavy weapon which it, and then they reversed it back to the destiny one system which everyone preferred because originally shotgun snipers and stuff like that were all in secondary uh, were all in your heavy slot basically so you had to have like um either it was, it was a co combination of two of them so it's either Auto rifles, horse rifles, so like um, semi-auto, burst fire, or full auto weapons, mm -hmm. or um, hand cannons. I feel like I'm missing another type of weapon. Hand cannons and sidearms, which are like just pistols basically. Hand cannons are your actual revolvers and stuff like that, and then you got your uh, sidearms. Right. Am I missing anything else? No, I think that's all it was. You have to have a combination of two of them basically. And then you had your heavy, which was like, um, typically in Destiny 1, you'd have um, a shotgun or a sniper as your secondary, but obviously you couldn't have that in Destiny 2, it had to be a heavy slot. But why would anyone want to run a shotgun or a sniper over, say, a rocket launcher or something like that? <laughs> so, right. they're basically quite used. <laughs> People were quite sad about that, basically, because the ammo was also quite weird, like your maximum ammo was quite shitty as well. So they changed all that back anyway now, so you can have like um, a sniper or a shotgun as your secondary. There are still some snipers and shotguns that go into your heavy one, but obviously they're like the really good ones, like the exotics and stuff like that, because... Mm -hmm. Yeah, for better super powerful. purposes. Yeah. <laughs> like they're, they're, the re they're the real fucking powerful ones, basically. That's the reason why they go there. So, most people are quite happy about that, basically. In PvP, it's a bit of a weird one, though, because it means you see a lot more shotguns in PvP, and shotguns are... Shotguns are hard to balance in PvP on Destiny. Because you even make them complete ass. And then everyone complains because then what's the point in having them there sort of thing? Or... Mm -hmm. you, you leave them as they are. Where... 
all you gotta do is like, really slide into someone and that's it. Because there's a lot of mobility in the game. There's a lot of ways to get around. There's a lot of ways to close in, close in on people and stuff like that. So, what the fuck was that sound? Am I still in Terraria? I could have sworn I fucking quit the game. <laughs> I guess not. <laughs> I heard a random sound. I was like, what? I'm kind of shook right now because like, I just stepped on the blue towel and now I'm a pink bunny, and the world has changed. So yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm looking at you out right now. <laughs> I'm just kind of like, what the fuck's going on? Oh god, what's this? Also, am I sounding robotic because it says my connection oh, is... Kind of a bit. Oh, yeah, there you go. Uh, no, check Discord. It doesn't say I'm losing frames on my recording. Or stream, rather. Speaking there. Test one to three, Kappa. There you go, yeah. yeah. Fine. Oh, weird. Uh, I, think it's a Discord server. I changed the Discord server from Central Europe to Western Europe and it's okay. Yeah. S sometimes Discord be like that. True, true. It do be like that sometimes. I wonder what that's from. I I'm sure that's not the first time I've heard it like recently, but still. <laughs> Weird yeah, names. I love to say, but I've no idea where it really, like most means to be honest. No one, no one really knows where it originated from. <laughs> it, it just sort of happened. Why, yeah. why is that guy kicking out a mushroom about? Uh, <laughs> I don't know. I actually don't know. What the fuck? He's just kind of mad. I can just keep fucking kicking the mushroom <laughs> guy about. Well, he doesn't seem to mind. It could be his kink. <laughs> Woo, holy shit, let's jump. Oh, I've already been here. So I guess you have to work tomorrow then? Yeah. <laughs> Feels bad, man. Alright, when do you start? Um, Near the end of March it is, but like next week I've got uh, a geotech assignment coming up. Well, assessment, so I've got to go away for like five days. Hmm. Oh, like I, I, got, I got my train tickets, but like the train tickets they sent me were dated for the fifteenth of January, it was like five days ago. So oh jeez. Tomorrow and just like asking what the fuck's going on with it, basically. Yeah. They got they got the right return date, but they haven't got the right send out date. I don't think so. I'll just get my phone tomorrow and ask them about it. Hmm. Where do I like, need to I would have gone today to pick up the tickets, but like I, I don't want to pick them up. If the dates and there's wrong, because then I don't, I don't know if they can get a refund for it then, so I'll just, I'll just find as far as I'm on with it. I'll send my ID comes in time, though, because my boss is going to send it over to me either tomorrow or Tuesday. And they've got to try and send it off and get it back by the end of Friday. Or, or, or by the end of Saturday, shall I say. So, like, hopefully, like, I, I'm paying, like, extra to get, like, next, it says next day service, but I've got to wait for it to go through the fucking the post office to get to them and from them basically so mm. like I, I trust the people i'm sending it to will get it sorted out fast like next day but i just, I just don't trust the delivery yeah so, although i don't think january's january's not really a peak time though for deliveries i don't really i don't think so anyway well, i would so i would expect it, yeah 20th of january hmm You'd think it'd be okay, really. Obviously, yeah. as it comes to Christmas, you expect to be real busy and stuff like that. But yeah, exactly. Just after it, I wouldn't really expect it too much. So I have to wait and see. And even though I know I asked my boss for like um, the secondary ID, so like basically what I used before, which was like um, some photographs and shit, basically. Photographs and a signed letter, basically what I had to use before. Wait, photographs and what? Um, my boss just signs a letter basically saying, you know, he, He's the owner of the company. He can verify the photos of me and stuff like that. Mm. So he's essentially doing what a normal ID card. What a normal ID a normal ID card is there basically to say, um, you know, the government verifies that this is you or whatever. Whereas this is just saying like someone in a good standing position verifies that you are who you say you are. Right. And you basically need that to get an ID in the first place anyway for the government to sort of accept it. Yeah. yeah. So essentially. I'm showing him an ID card without actually showing an ID card <laughs> kind of thing. It, it, it's not as well sort of not, not, not expected what's the word I'm looking for. It, it's, it's not as well accepted because obviously it can be easier forged than um, 
an official ID or whatever. Mm -hmm. But it's better than nothing, basically. Yeah. But what would I do actually if I get this idea though? Like life would be just something. I should have got it sorted out a lot earlier. It's just stupid of me not to get it done earlier, to be honest. But I was always like, nah, we're fine, fine. Because I, I never knew I had to go to this assessment. Like, all I knew I had to do was my assessment centre, and then I thought it was as simple as yes, no, and then you wait to get given a date, basically. That's all I thought it was going to be. But it, I didn't know I had to do this test in between it. It's like five days, ten tests, or some shit like that. Mm -hmm. So, it'll be interesting. Busy program. Five days away from home. Oh, well, yeah. I mean, it's five days of free food. <laughs> free food, <laughs> like, free is, food and no cooking. It's like, oh, yeah. Is it at least good food, though? Uh, well, when I was at the assessment center, the food there was pretty nice, to be honest. Hmm. It, it, it's like the breakfast was like a cook's breakfast, so you got like sausage egg and stuff like that. Not bad, not and bad. then you also had like unlimited cereal and unlimited toast as well. Coffee, tea, whatever you wanted basically. Alright. That's nice. The, the drinks were like unlimited throughout the day. But obviously you couldn't really go back into the cafe midday. You, you, you get three meals, so you get your lunch. But you get your breakfast when you wake up. Mm -hmm. You get um, you get your lunch about midday. Between what, between 12 and 2 o'clock or whatever. And then you have your actual dinner in the night about 6, 7 o'clock. And that's what you get. You do have the option to buy like snacks or whatever if you do get a package or whatever, but they're, they're the three meals that they'll provide for you. Right, right, right. So basically, the ones in, they provide are good. enough to get you sorted. Yeah. Simple as that, really. Are you lost, sir? Like, I'm, I'm just watching you just run around in the circle. <laughs> yeah, I am fucking lost. You're right. <laughs> I just made a save point, let like the top and the bottom, so like if I go to yeah. the wrong per place, I can just walk back. Like, this is the fucking fairy place, isn't it? Yep, fuck me. What is this? Hold on, I'm just gonna load. Can you speak the fairy at all, or will she just put you back to the other place? Nah, she, she just heals you. I don't know what the fuck uh, these are. These look like fucking dicklets from Pokemon. Oh yeah, the ones that have spikes next to the minute. Yeah. <sighs> what is this? I should have never stepped on that fucking towel. What a mistake. <laughs> this is the top again, I think. Yep. I'm just gonna talk to them again, see what I can... What do they say? I know one of them says something about a moon stone. That's yeah, yeah. Mm. Moon pearl from the Tower of Hera. I, like, I bet the tower is that fucking glowing building. The one that flashes in, like, all the colors. Mm. Moon Pearl, yes, I know. <laughs> he does get kicked around a lot. Oh, he's apparently turned into a ball. He looks like a fucking mushroom. <laughs> he looks like Kirby like to me. <laughs> <laughs> or a pink Goomba from Mario. What if I... J oh, fucking hell. Is, like, can I fast forward? I need to find out. Uh... No, probably, but I can't, I can't figure it out in time. <sighs> God damn it. I could, like, I could be an uh, heli because he beat this game, but... Hmm. Oh, wait. there's a secondary there. Oh, wait, never mind. Okay. Yeah, it's like a dead end. Maybe I can use this. Oh, thank God. Or, wait, what does it do? Oh! Okay. Shit. Actually, I'm gonna warp back. Hold on. Oh, okay. I figured it out. So, you went into that tunnel with the spike things there. Would that have changed? Yeah, I think. Let's see, so if I warp back here, it should give me, like, the towel again. Yep. 
Aha, I see, I see, I see. A smart boy. Oh, yeah. I didn't know the mirror could do that. Oh, I can't use it indoors. Oh. What? Oh, there's no finger there anymore, is there? No hole. Yeah. Okay, let's see, maybe I can... Wait, is there a map? Oh, oh boy. Anyway, I think I'm gonna leave the cool thing, so I gotta go for a bath now. I said that like a half an hour ago, but... <laughs> yeah, fair enough, fair enough. I'll talk to you later then. Peace, man. Later. Alright. Oh, I can't get through here. <laughs> what is going on? Well, I'm gonna make the sound a bit louder. Uh, let's see. That might be too loud. Uh, let's try this. God, this is mind fucking. I'm gonna try changing back here. Oh, there's a cave. Oh, right. At least back to the normal area. I don't know if I should take that. <laughs> what is this? Ah, see, I'm smart. I saw that fucking spot. I'm I'm a smart boy. Nope. Well, I mean, uh, I've played it like a couple days ago, but I've never beaten it. It's all new for me. Alright, this takes me level down, I think. Yeah, I I think I uh, I've played on a an, on an NES or SNES before when I was way younger, but it was Mario. I've never played any Zeldas, the old Zeldas it is. Keep it. Oh, all right. Yep. It's funny. Uh, I don't know if I if I said it when you were already wa already uh, watching, but I started playing this because uh, I knew this game does uh, stuff like this, right? Where if you press against the corner of a wall, it uh, moves you around it, and I wanted that in my game. And then I started playing more of this, and I was like, "Wow, this is actually really cool!" So now I want to play more of it. Uh, okay, so to the right, fairies. Let's check here. Like the only Zeldas I've really played were the DS ones, and I don't know, they are right, but I do like this more. I also need to continue playing Ocarina of Time, but I don't know, for now I just want to play this. There's something nostalgic about it, even though I've never played it. Uh, I don't want to jump down. Maybe I should, though. 
Okay, fuck it, I'm gonna do it. Oh shit, oh shit. Oh. Also, this game is hard. This game is pretty hard. Which I do like. Oh, I think I just went backwards. Uh, maybe? No, I think I did. Or maybe I didn't. Shit. I'm not lost, no. Oh yeah, okay. This is where the man is. I was actually thinking of... Um, imagine a randomly generated version of Permadeath. Oh, did, did someone make that? Like a ROM hack or another game? Oh wait, you're talking about... Uh, <laughs> you're talking about Binding of Isaac, aren't you? Or am I tripping? Like this with permadeath would be pretty sick. Something like this. Oops. Oh. So I, I guess I want to find a spot just like here where I can change back and then I can access a new area. Um, no, I haven't. That's the, like the platformer one, isn't it? I know um, like Dark Link or Shadow Link is in that game. So I remember. Should probably heal. Yeah, because like the first game was like this one. Where it's like top down. Then the second game was uh, that. Zelda 2, where it was from the side. Is this the third game in the series? I was never sure. Uh, okay, I already went here, so I'm just gonna change back, it's faster. Oh shit. <laughs> Oh really? I thought it was just completely uh like a completely side side scrolled or whatever I should call it. I mean Oh yeah, see? Right, 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 right. See the 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 thing that I'm thinking of for my game right now is to make the overworld like Zelda, basically. But then uh, make the encounters different. I guess it would be pretty similar to Zelda 2. Except it wouldn't be like a beat em up, but it would be a like an RPG with like turn based commands and stuff. I don't know if it will work out, but I do want to make it. I'm just kind of stuck right now. I just, like, I start uh, working on the new battle system, but I'm kind of dumb. I, I planned a lot of st stuff ahead, which made it easier to make, but then I forgot to, uh, like, there's a list of characters that participate in battle. And, I don't know, I'm just dumb. I forgot to add a function that removes or adds characters, like, at the start of developing it. So now, if I want to implement it now, it's going to be a pain in the ass, because some stuff is added already. 
without taking into consideration that there could be more or less characters. So that was retarded. Make it more like this kind of game, action RPG. Yeah, like I could probably fix it still. Um, in fact, I'm pretty sure. I just need to use my brain. God, what am I even doing? I went here, I'm pretty sure. This area is confusing. Uh, I just need to, uh, just need to use my brain. Okay, I need to also use my brain for this game. Let's check the map. All right, so the sparkle thingy which changes the world is down there. There's two cave entrances and there's also like two here on the left. Actually, let me check again. Hmm. Like the one on the bottom left, that one's like the fairy one. And then this one is like the, the entrance to the cave with the man in it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I'm pretty sure you're, you're right. The question is just uh, where. That's what I'm trying to figure out. Hmm. Like the benefit of being this character, this bunny, is that there's no enemies. Let's check the map again. Oh, I can't even see the cave entrances here. Yeah, I tried that. That's where I got the uh, piece of heart. Maybe I should just change back here and go into the cave. See what's up. Like it says it goes back to Kakariko village, which is like this like the town area. Oh, I think oh, I've been here before. Yeah. Yeah, like there's this giant disco tower right here. Mm. Like I know you can do it here. Because that, like, puts you up. Wait, can I... Oh my god, you can jump, can't you? Yep, I'm an idiot. <laughs> I didn't know you could jump. Oh, I figured it out. Also, I'm almost dead. What's this? Oh, I need to book, don't I? Ooh. Well, I don't have the Master Sword yet. Well, that is one thing I do like about this uh, game. It's when you finally figure out how to uh, continue. It's like, yay. That's the same with coding, to be honest. Like, right now I'm stuck. But once I figure out how to advance it, it's going to feel very good. Alright, let's uh oh wait. Hold on. Mm, oh right, yeah, I can't I I I can only enter this place as Link, I'm pretty sure. So let's do that. Oh boy, what is this? Ah Okay. Actually I'm gonna save. Let's do that. Slot one. The cancer dungeon. Oh boy. 
I thought the last dungeon was bad. The sand place was pretty... Like, it's not too tough, but at the first time it kind of kicked my ass. I don't like these uh, worm thingies though, they're annoying. Oh, okay. <laughs> but basically for my game, I would I would like to have something like these dungeons, where it's kind of puzzle based. I think that would be pretty fun. Uh, what does it say? Oh, okay, that's good to know. Oh, those things look like Resnor from... I don't know which game, it was a Mario game. Mario World, maybe? Mario 3, maybe? I don't know. Right. Wait, we're in floor two. What? Hmm. Oh, yeah, that's a good point. That's a good point. Oh, shit. Like, um... Uh, what's this called? Fire Emblem Echoes. Um... I don't know if that actually had puzzles per se, but like it had it had encounters in dungeons and some of the encounters were like once only, so I could probably do the same in uh, my game, where it's like only once instead of random. Actually it's not, uh, there's like no actual random encounters, it's just like, um, there, there's these overworld enemies and if you touch them then you get into a battle. So you can avoid it. Oh shit. What? 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 I don't like that. That could have killed me. Also, I should probably not use this book. What the hell am I doing? I need to find a heart so this beeping just stops. Oh right, yeah, that's the texture, right? Where if you fall down, it takes you to, to a different floor. Wait, what am I doing? I can't go down there. I'm just gonna try falling down, I have a fairy. Yep. Nah, man, I have balls of steel. Clearly. Can I just find a heart? Please, this beeping. Oh, I just went here. Um... Oh wait, I can go here. Except I went here already. Wait, wait, wait. Oops. <laughs> it's always the last button that I press and it does nothing. Okay. I'm probably supposed... No, never mind. I was thinking maybe you could uh, like push something in, in here from the top. But probably not. Hmm. Oh wait, hold on. Yeah. How was this? I have no idea. Yeah, I saw the I saw the locks. So I was like, I can't go in there. But uh, 
because of the other door, which needs a big key, but that one probably just needs a normal key. Alright, let's go. Oh fuck, oh this is it, I'm dead. These tiles. <laughs> these tiles. I think multiple people uh, have trouble with these tiles. And rip. But I have a fairy, so it's okay. Motherfuckers. No. These things are vicious, dude. Also, I can hit the towel. What am I doing? Or the switch. Oh. What? Oh, I can... <laughs> oh, never mind. Oh, you just had to wait it out. Okay. Oops. Oh, I don't like those things. Like the normal skeletons are annoying, but they didn't throw bones. Oops. Nice. Now we can go to that other room, which has the big door. You know, there's, me, there's me doing this for the first time, and it takes a while, right? And then there's other people that, like, uh, <laughs> they beat this game in, like, one hour or something. It's crazy. I need to hit the switch. No, 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 none of that, sir. None of that, sir. Get out. The worst enemy. All right. What am I doing? <laughs> Nope. Nope! <laughs> They're like fucking the bumpers in pinball machines. I should probably try to boomerang them. Oh, okay, that does nothing. See, they're <laughs> even if you hit them without getting hit yourself, they just bounce you back. All right. Get wrecked. Oh yeah. All right. Let's see. Can go this way. Floor four, geez. This is a big place, isn't it?
Oh, I need to be careful. Can I stun those things or can I not? Nope. Okay. Okay, I can do that. Okay, thank god. Yoink! Get the rupees. I should buy something. I have like 700. Oh, that, those are from Mario. Oh, okay, I just fall. Uh, I don't know. Also, <laughs> I don't think arrows work on those guys. Oh shit, that, that bounces me, okay. Ah, oh, bounces them too. Oh, uh, I don't like this. Oh, I'm dead. What? Did that thing hit me for two? Also, the fairy. I didn't know. Did that thing just do two hearts of damage? Or am I just bad? Uh. Yeah, they are bad. They're immune to this, they're immune to this. Uh, okay, fuck it. Wait, wait, hold on. No, 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 no. I know the strategy. Get out. Oh, I bombs, yes. What? Okay, guess it doesn't work. Hold on, I have a map. I could have checked. <laughs> I'm bad at this game. Uh, it's this button. Oh, right, it's a tower, right. Uh, right, okay, there you go. Meow. Oh, this is the boss, isn't it? Yep, hello. Can I go back? I can, okay. I'm gonna save. Just so I don't have to walk all the way back if I die. It's not cheating. Kappa. Oh, I think I know what's going on. It's gonna knock me down. Over and over. Yep. Okay. I see why this boss is shit now. <laughs> it's gonna... Oh, God. Yep. Oh, that's... Hello. That's knockback. <laughs> that's some knockback indeed. And I need to hit the tail, I have to bet. Oh. Oh, and it's gonna go faster every time I hit it, isn't it? Oh my god. Eee. Oh. <laughs> no! Come on, come on. See, I don't like when you hit when you walk towards the edge, it kind of sucks you in. Come on, stop, stop. Bitch. I can already see myself falling down once and then 
When I land on the bottom floor, I fall down again. Oh, that's right, a chest, huh? Where the fuck's the chest? <laughs> uh, oh, it's on floor four. Good idea. I will concede that. Oh, uh, I probably have to jump down from the top, don't I? Nope. Or I do. Now I have to do this. Oh. Um, this is fun. Hmm. I'm gonna check if I can jump down. Mm, doesn't seem like it. Nope. Maybe if I press this? Yep. You bitch! I, I, can I move when I fall? Holy shit. That's sneaky. I like that. But it's very cheeky. Let's try it again. Oh. I have to... F Jump down here. Move up. Oh, I can't even move, but there you go. Yes! Fuck it. Ah, oh, that didn't work. Oh, 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 oh! <laughs> that almost backfired. I'm not i uh, I'm not a good archer, I think. I think that's a fair assessment to make. Also, this is not, like... Hmm. If I, if I hit him with like the spin, it knocks him back way, way back. Oops. Nope. Now the real question is, does his health regenerate? I think it does, when I fall down. Okay. I got him, somehow. No! Fuck. Oh, come on! See, there it is! Did I already mention that I want to make a second channel so I can post stuff like this on there? I could post it on my main. It's not like I have that many subs. It just feels like a shame to just... Uh, 
waste all this footage with commentary. Piece of shit. <laughs> oh my god, why? <sighs> this is hell. <laughs> I'm gonna save when I get there. It's when you charge like the spin, when you get close to the edge, that's when you get wrecked. Alright. Save Reno. Yeah, I was thinking that as well. It's just a normal attack does piss damage. But it's better than nothing. And right now the spin is doing pretty much nothing. Get him, boy! Imagine seeing this thing in real life. I would freak out, dude. Skittering all over the place. Well, that didn't work. With those giant eyes. <laughs> oh shit, oops. Nope, nope. <laughs> okay. Okay, no fairies. Mm. I wonder if this does anything. If I like somehow stun the tail, if that does anything. Probably not. Oh, getting sucked in again. Ah. You move so fast, or rather, you just turn so fast. Okay, I'm dying. Oh, come on. Nope, no, no, no. I don't want to walk all the way back. That does heal me, but. I mean, I was going to reset if I die anyway. Oh! Oh! Pro, pro, pro. Look at this. Ultra Instinct! No! <laughs> no, I don't want to choke it! What the hell, dude? <gasps> He's so fast! What the hell? Nope! Oh my god! Dude! That was insane! And my suspicions were correct, he does regenerate because he's slower. Okay. Just got it over with, you bastard. There's probably fan art of this thing, which looks absolutely terrifying. I don't know if I said that already. 
Okay, I'm dead. Do -do 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 -do. We'll try that again. Yeah. Alright. But that thing has a has a bigger hitbox than it looks. But it's still pretty tough. Ouch. Hmm. I only form bomb. That's kind of a shame. That's better than this bow, I think, maybe. Nope. Ouch. Oh, come on. <laughs> Might as well reset. Cause I'm gonna die. This would be hell without save states. Having to climb back up the tower every time you get killed. Oof. No, wrong direction. No! God, I'm getting wrecked. <laughs> yeah, you would know. You played it on the OG console. I'm just being a pleb with an emulator and a controller. I am pl playing with like this filter though. I like that. Like the, the thing that uh, makes the scan lines appear on the screen. I thought it was nice. Oh god. <laughs> He's so fast! Come on! This is gonna take a while. Or maybe it will be this attempt. I can say one thing. This boss is currently harder than the Marble Colossus. For, for me. Yeah. I doubt they would give a boss like this that much health. Or maybe they would, I don't know. Oh god. Ooh, that was close. Nope. <laughs> Get him. Yes. Be gone. Da -da 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 ah, it feels good, man. I got all the pendants. Yes. Yes. I love the... I really, really love the music in the Lost Woods. Also, I still need to find a remix of it. Also, I need to get back. Um... Also, I need to save. How about that? Save Reno. I guess probably because of uh, limitations, but it's pretty rough uh, playing this game without save states. Because every time you boot up the game, you would have to start at uh, the sanctuary. Which is why I don't really like Ocarina of Time right now, because every time I, I boot up the game, I have to start out at the fucking village. Even though I was last like in Hyrule Castle or whatever. 
That's just dumb. Made sense back in the day, but now... I don't know. Also, I'm getting wrecked. Please heal. Oh yeah, I have the thingy, the pearl. I need to try it out. Oh, uh, I've probably seen screenshots of that, but that does sound good. I would like to try some more NES games, or SNES. It's like a whole catalog of games that I've never gotten to play because I never had an, I never had an SNES. Oh, 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 this is the theme. Da -da -da -da, da -da -da -da. I was listening to this non-stop when I was coding at some point. It's very good. I like most of the songs in this game. It's pretty, pretty good stuff. Because it's very melody driven. I guess. Uh, okay, that does not actually make me go faster. There's nothing here, I believe. Nope. Can I actually... Nope. I can't lift those rocks. I can't do anything with this either. I wonder why Link has pink hair in this game. There's probably a very good reason. And I know... Oh shit, what? <laughs> yeah. Uh, I think if I change back here, I can go back to the cave that goes to the village. Yes. So we we'll go back to the village and then to the Lost Woods forest. Oops. Oh. All right. Oh, that's how you get here. I see, I see. Yeet. All right, they shock you. I wonder what those enemies are even called. They look like choo-choos, but I don't know if they're actually choo-choos. See, we have to go to the left. And then go up. Oh shit, oh shit. No, no. Not today, motherfuckers. Get stunned for like 10 seconds. Oh, there's a house. My face win.
I'm gonna enter. Boy. Oh. There's nothing here. Yeah, that's not it. I know where the real sword is, it's like at the top left. So I don't know where I'm going here. Rest in peace music. I heard it's gonna change when I get the sword. Welcome back. Alright, let's get it. And there goes the fog. And the music, I think. Yay. No, the music. This is a good tune, but, you know. Help. Oh. Can I use this? Nope. I want to see how much damage I do. Can I talk? Nope. Oh, there they are! <laughs> I also, I one shot at them. That's awesome. I feel strong. But I'm sure I'm going to feel weak very soon. Oh. I can't get past here, can I? Nope. You know what I find super impressive? Like this ROM was only 4 megabytes. That's fucking mental. I, I know there's like a, this challenge or something that developers do sometimes where they try to make a game using only a very limited space. It's pretty cool. Oh. Oh, this is how I get the piece of heart. Yeah, I know, right? That's what makes it so impressive. Oh, there you are. I actually know that those were there before. Ah, oh, it feels so good to one-shot them. Nope. I've used this surfaces once and it was actually pretty useful. Well, the second time, the first time it wasn't. Uh, I need to go to the right. Actually, no. I need to buy stuff. I have too much money. Oh, <laughs> don't worry. I've tried that before. They, uh... I, I guess you could say they didn't like it. Is that like a, like a little meme? In like every Zelda game, where if you bully a chicken, you just get an avalanche of, of anger. <laughs> I 
guards. Come on, I just want to buy something, guys. I think... Um, uh, Zelda Four Swords Adventures does it as well. But that game is like super based on this game. The game is really weird, but it's also really cool. Also, it's a game that I've never gotten to play. Because I had no GameCube. I don't know what I'm doing. I just need to get into a shop. This is not a shop. I do need some bombs. Oh, no! <laughs> ah, story for my life. Oh! Oh, of course! How could I forget? The fucking beam. That's like the coolest thing ever. The beam when you have uh, full health, that's so cool. Get wrecked. Just get destroyed. Can I actually... nope, I can't look at the sword. This is the era before item tooltips. Yeah. It's like an infinite supply of bombs. Ha! Why would you ever buy this? That's a good meme. I forgot where I saw it. I, I saw a video because I, I think I was looking up the footage for like the nudging around the walls like this for my game and then I saw someone like walk in there and, and do that. Where's the shop here? Wait, I just went to a shop. What am I saying? Wait a minute. Have I gone here yet? Oh. That's not gonna do it, is it? I just misplaced it. Oh, never mind. How have I never got gone here? Oh. Does that respawn as well? Nope. See, I always try to chase this guy, but he just despawns. Not sure if he can. Anyway, I should go to the sanctuary already. I'm gonna save, just in case. Oh boy. No, he's got a despawn. Rest in peace. Alright. Now the castle, the music there, holy shit. That's something as well. It's like the first song you hear, but it's amazing. Also, these guys are really wanting to kill me. Nope, nope, nope. 
you just ruined my sword. Nope, nope. Fucking B. Nope. That's bad. Let's just get in before I get destroyed. Wrecked, wrecked. Oh, damn it. I just want hearts. There you go. So I can fire my lasers. Ah, whatever. I guess I'm not supposed to go here. Big boy. Get destroyed. Select the coolest power up. Oh god. Uh... Oh. I can get rid of it. Now for the real dungeon. Yeah, get out. Get the fuck out. I just hope that guy can't path find to me. <laughs> get wrecked. Get wrecked. This is like the best power up ever. Nope. 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 I'm gonna lose the best power up ever. Ooh. Ooh. I'm kinda... Kinda overestimating his power. Oh, shit. Okay. This is getting intense because I just don't want to get hit at all. As this power-up is so good. I can just scan enemies in the darkness. It's broken, dude. I should probably not pick up the pots because of the hearts. Okay, there might be a key under a pot though. Okay, I don't know what did that. Ah, oh, I can do this. Nope. Yep. Oh, 
Why don't they remake this game? Well, I guess they kind of did. With Link Between Worlds. I should have gotten that game. Not Ocarina of Time. Who cares about that? Classic, sure, but oh my god. Dated. This isn't flawless either, but I'm liking it more. Also, I should really boomerang. Okay, rip, rip, rip. <laughs> Give me a heart. Nope. Light it up. Oh, does that do it permanently if I do that? I mean, I'm gonna have to be fast because, yeah. Oh, uh, it's the door, isn't it? Maybe. Shit. Now I can't make it. Shit. That doesn't help. Yeah, fuck. There's too many torches. Or, no, I, I did light them all. Didn't really do anything. Nope. I just went back because I wanted to refill my hearts. Why did that not work? Oh! You shitter, you shitter. Get out. Ah, oh, it's gonna unstun. Okay, got him. Well, what's this? I'm just gonna spam this. I don't care. See, I wonder what that does. Pushing those blocks. Because it makes a sound effect of like a mechanism. Hmm. No idea. Oh. No. <sighs> Fuck. These things are annoying. I have a shield, which I should just use. Get fucked. Okay, I didn't miss anything. Let's continue. Oh, this is bad. <laughs> These are like archers on crack or something. Don't think my shield works. Yes. Oh, that's reassuring.
Actually, I should check for hearts, thinking about it. There we go. Oh boy. No, I'm gonna get hit. Never mind. Ooh. Just machine gun him. Ooh. Oh dear. What's this? I'm pretty sure I can pick up those statues. Oh, I see. I'm just gonna skip it. Bye bye. I know what this means. Oh, there he is. No, not best girl. Ah, uh, epilepsy. I can't actually hit him, I need to reflect it or something. Oh. Oh, okay. I need to be careful with that. Whoa, what the fuck? <laughs> How do I know he's gonna do that? Shit. This is, uh... Okay. Man, this is very, uh... Precise. Damn it! How am I supposed to know he's gonna do that? I guess don't stand under him is the name of the game. Fuck. Do a fairy? Nope. Oh, okay, so whenever he's at the top and he aims down, that's when you know. Oh. This is tough. Oh, I thought he was gonna do the thunder. Bolt. Thunderbolt. And I thought he was gonna do it there. Now he's gonna do it. I guess it's always from that spot. I hope. I'm probably gonna die. Yeah. Oh, every five attack, not... Not like every five attack is every five. 
Boink. Come on, I can do it. I've got the power. Yes. Well met. Oh, what? 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 Wow. Oh, I've seen this. I've seen like an image of this. Now I'm actually here. To link the worlds. I see what they did there. At Hyrule Castle. Ah, oh, that's why the new game is called Link Between Worlds. Yes. Oh boy. Please make this old man's wishes come true. Oh. Oh, thanks for the heal. Yes, this song. Also, I'm gonna save. This song is amazing. I don't know for how much longer I'm gonna play. I guess until I find like a town area or something. Oh, got faked out again. Oh, these are big boys. Yeah, that quest for dependence was only the beginning, wasn't it? Now the real game starts. Maybe. I have no idea how long this game is, but it seems decently long. Which is good. Nope, 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 nope. Oh my god, it's always the bees. Wait, what? Thinking. Like, that's so cool. You have the normal world, and then you have like a complete alternate version of it. Which I'm sure, like, I'm sure one of the reasons was to save memory. Or something. But it's still really cool. Also, I got hit. Rest in peace. My lasers! This probably does nothing. Oh, never mind. Knights in Realm only wish they had this ability. The boomerang. Stuns for 10 seconds. Has like 6 range. Seems pretty good.
Oh, I guess the big guys are the, like they're stunnable, but it's for a shorter period of time. I don't need that right now. Okay, I need to go up. Where was that? No idea. Questions for later. I wonder what a randomizer for this is like. So I know it's a thing. Wait, what? Rest in peace, tree boy. Ah, oh, what's this? Ah. How far are we? Almost there. Oh. Can I push this? Nope. Just, this is like so satisfying. This attack. I don't know why. Maybe it's the fact that you can like spam it. I don't know. Just feels good. Something fucking going on here. Aha. Uh -huh. Oh, <laughs> God, no. Oh, okay. You can see, you can tell by these like dark colors here. Where an entrance is. That's pretty useful. Nope. Just a shadow. I know, um, Smooth McGroove did a cover of this team. It's pretty good. Oh! Yes, I can. I accept your company, monkey boy.
Yes. Easy. Oh yeah, the music is different in these dungeons. Alright. Time to save. And then close.